Hey, ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Welcome back. This is Force here with the second boss in Heroic Hidden Laboratory. This is Maloriac, and for this matchup, we are playing Zoo. Um, I want to keep the Shredder. Yeah, you know, let's go ahead and keep it. Uh, so for this matchup, we're going to be playing Zoo, and the general principle here is we're all about value and board control. And the main reason is, is because he gets out ridiculously huge minions uh, super early on. And that's because his hero power here, as you can see, it switches the health and attack of all minions, but his minions also get plus two, plus two. So he just ends up with like these huge things in place super early. Like this is gonna turn into a four five, look at that. It's ridiculous. It is absolutely ridiculous. Gets plus two, plus two, then switches it up. Um, I think we're actually just gonna play the Imp Gang boss now though and attack him in the face. I know I could kill that thing with a Dark Bomb, but I want to hold on to it just to see what else he plays. Uh, secret isn't exactly... Alright. Um, so the secrets that he have are mage secrets, so we always got to keep those in mind with whatever happens. Like this trade, though. Walk into that. Play our big dude. Alright, so he ends up getting the duplicate there. Our shredder is going to turn into a 3-4 because that's Swapperoo. But this is what we want. We've got board control right now, so I'm actually really happy he played an early secret. Sludge Belcher is painful, but we do have the answer with Dark Bomb. And then we can, uh, yeah, this will work out perfectly, actually. So we're going to Dark Bomb this for three damage. Let's play the Imp Gang boss. We're going to kill it off. And then his 1-2, I believe, turns into a 4-3? Yeah, that's right, because it, it gets plus 2, plus 2, and then it swaps. So, uh, Flesh Eating Ghoul. That thing can get painful in this matchup. That's the 4-4. Four, four. <clears throat> okay, so I think I'm just going to take advantage of our Argus right now and just go for his face. Try to start working him down because he's going to have to get through these things. He doesn't have, I, at least I haven't seen any board sweepers from him or anything. It's only like minions that he's able to get through our stuff with. Uh, let's just play this, yeah. I don't really want to, don't really need to tap right now, especially with our hand here. So it, so, I, I haven't seen any, like, I haven't seen, like, a Hellfire or anything crazy from him. Although, again, he looks, you know, I don't know, whatever. We'll see, I don't know, he could, I, I've only beat him once so far. I haven't done this matchup too many times, so he might have some surprises for me, which, God, I hope not. Okay, let's see what we draw here. Like the Knife Juggler. We can go Knife Juggler Argus, see what it hits. Maybe we get lucky and it hits the 7-1 and we don't have to toss away one of our 1-1s. One that would be ideal. All right, so let's see what happens. We're going to stick him right here. Knife goes to his face. All right, whatever. We'll just trade into the 1-1, and then we just hit him in the face with the rest of this. Uh, this has been this is very good so far. We could play the Doomguard next turn, and then whatever else we draw, so long as it is uh, four or less. Or, excuse me, three or less. Yeah, so long as it's three or less casting. He's got two secrets now. That's kind of annoying. Um, all right, perfect. So we can play the flame up. See if he's got a mirror entity. No, he does not. All right, so then we play the Doom Guard, which this is actually works in our favor. Oh god, another duplicate. Uh, this works in our favor because this turns into a seven-five for us, which I really like. And then let's make sure it's not vaporized. It is not. Okay, perfect. Look at this, man. Look at this. Full board control, we got the Dr. Boom coming up here. Perfecto. Alright, these are, this is that's a very annoying spell. These guys turn into 3-3s three with charge. Normally they're just 1-1s, one but because of the heroic pump up. Although I don't know, none of this saves him. I guess unless he's got an ice block. Uh is he gonna switch? Five, six, oh, well, we still have eight. So unless that's ice block or ice armor, we should win. Ooh, my goodness. Guess we'll just play this for the extra. Okay, well, I'm actually, I was, that might've been stupid because that could've been a copy, but oh well, whatever. We got the win here anyways. Uh, so there you go, guys. Zoo works. Just focus on board control, trying to get as much value out of your minions as possible. Uh, we got pretty lucky this time around with those double Argus draws. That definitely, I, I, that allowed us to do enough damage to push through for the victory, so that, that ended up working out very well for us. But uh, this is my second time winning with this list, so give it a shot, see how it works for you. 
Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. The other two bosses coming up. Take it easy.